Hey, good morning. Before we start our class, let's thank God before we start. Okay, let the prayer, guys. Okay? Thank you. Before we start our lesson for today, what is squared of binomial? So, square of a binomial. Who can tell me what is a binomial? Anyone? Okay. Thank you. So, what is a binomial? But before that, let's read the objectives. The objectives. At the end of the lesson, the student must be able to learn what is a binomial. Second, how to solve binomial. The third, squaring binomial. So, what is a binomial? Who can read? <laughs> okay. Binomial. There is an example how to solve binomial. The first example is x plus 3 squared. So, how to solve this? First, we should square the first term, which is x squared. Then, next, twice the product of the two terms. These are 2x times 3. Then, next, square the last term. So, we come up with the answer with x squared plus 6x plus 9. So, in the other example, there are other methods. The other student or the other teacher teaches students how to use FOIL method. This is the method first, outer, inner, last. So, who, who can tell me here to know uh, that they know how to use FOIL method? This is a method that we solve from first, outer, inner, last. So, this is how this is how we use FOIL method. First, x times x is equal to x squared. Next, x times 3 is equal to 3x. That is the outer. And next, the inner will be 3 times x is equal to 3x. And the last is 3 times 3 is equal to 9. Then, the answer would be become x squared plus 6x, which is from 3x plus 3x, then we should bring down the 9. In, in the other student, you know that it is easy because it is all positive. What if the equation is negative? Like this. The second example is 2x minus 5 squared. So how can, how can we solve binomial in negative side. So, just like the first example, we should follow the first, square the first term, second, twice the product of the two term, and next, square the last term. So, the answer of this is will be become 4x squared minus 20x plus 25. So, who can, who can tell me that the answer in the board is correct? Okay, thank you. So, this is the FOIL method of the second example. So, just like the first example, just solve the first, which is 2 times 3 is equal to 4x squared. The next, 2 times 2x times negative 5 will become negative 10x, then the inner, uh, that is with the inner, and the other is negative, uh, minus 10x, which is from 5 times, negative 5 times 2x, and the last is negative 5 times negative 5 would become positive 25. And the answer is 4x squared minus 20x plus 25. So, that would be all about the example. 
So I have an activity here, an indi individual activity for each and one, so so that you can you can learn how to sew by yourself. So it is five items, <coughs> and and I will give you ten minutes to sew this. Okay, your time is up. So, we will check our activity. So, from one, who can answer number one, number two, number three, number four, and number five. Okay? So, let's, us, let's proceed with our next activity. This activity is a group activity. Just count one to two then that would be your group. So, your activity is one, two, three, four, five. There are five activities. So, the first activity is activity x plus 24 squared. And the second is x minus 17 squared. The third is x minus 35 squared. The fourth is x plus 25 squared. Then, the last is x minus 30 squared. So, just so that I will give you 20 minutes, each group. Then I will give five, five, plus, uh, five plus five for those students or those uh, group that they can, they can fast earlier. Okay, thank you. I have your active, uh, I have an assignment for you guys to be answered and you should pass it to me tomorrow. These are 10, 10, 10 items, then each each item has 5 points, so it would be it would be nice if you can give the solution properly and see you tomorrow